necklace. Maybe not today. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's all there. Um, first of all, I'm sorry if you guys are gonna be hearing a little sound in the background, but that is just my fan because right now I'm literally sweating. I know it sounds disgusting, but I'm sweating so badly because it's so hot in here. But anyways, I got inspired to do this video because finally I am an owner of my own little desk, which I got at Ikea. The minute that I saw it was like, this is this is mine. Like, it's meant to be mine. Um, of course, I got it in the color white because I'm obsessed with it as you can tell in my background and what I'm wearing. But anyways, I got it and I needed to decorate it, so I was like, uh, DIYs here, duh. But hopefully you guys get inspired to do this. They were super easy and very inexpensive. And that's our two favorite words here, easy and inexpensive. But they do look like very like <sighs> anthropology status. You know what I mean? I literally just feel like so important when I'm in my desk and I'm like, can you please knock on my office before you come in? It's literally my room, but I, that's what I say. But hopefully you guys like this video and without any further ado, Starting off, I'm going to transform this basic candle into an art piece. Basically, I'm going to paint the lid gold. Fair warning, we are going to use a lot of gold throughout this video. Anyway, second step is to take all the stickers off the candle. So when my lid is dry, I'm going to glue this crystal on top that I got from Michaels. But that is it guys, in less than a few minutes, I made this anthropology decor piece without spending the big bucks. Underneath the palm trees, you can leave your worries. Listen to the words, you say you wanna get so high. You breathe me in like air tonight. A cool way to keep your pens and pencils all organized is to keep them in a cute mason jar. To make them cute, once again, I'm going to take the lids and paint them gold. Then I'm gonna paint both mason jars with this really pretty blue chalk paint. You can choose another color if you wish, but I just chose blue because literally it's my fave. And can we just admire like my little henna that I got at the fair? Literally my parents almost killed me because they thought that it was real, but they're Mexican so like they literally just wanna kill me for like every little single thing I do. <laughs> Anyways, back to the video. So once everything is dry, just put the lid back on and throw in all your pencils and you're set to go. Also in the middle, I put this mug with my name initial and it wouldn't be a desk without a mug decor. Baby, don't you know? In order to keep us motivated, we need inspiration. So to do this canvas, I'm starting off by drawing and cutting a perfect circle in this decorative paper. Then I'm going to glue it with a little bit of Mod Podge, but obviously I put too much. Um, in the corners, I'm going to glue sticker flowers, but first I'm seeing what looks best. So just play around with them. Final step is to write your favorite quote that truly motivates you. Mine is adventure awaits because well, I'm always up for adventure, especially if I get out of my comfort zone. So yeah guys, that's all you have to do for this canvas and you're done. For my last DIY, I'm going to show you how to redecorate your planner. Mine is all boring and plain. Obviously, it needs life, so I painted it all black. Mind you that my agenda is hard co cover, co cover, cover, there you go. So, that's embarrassing. So if yours isn't, you can always cover it with black paper. While I let my planner dry, I'm gonna make some stars and moons with this gold paper. They don't have to be perfect by any means because clearly mine aren't. But when you have a few, just glue them with Mod Podge all over your agenda. And when you like what you see, cover the whole book in Mod Podge. Again, I did go crazy with the Mod Podge. Literally today was just not my day. <laughs> 
but once it dries down then I'm gonna take a gold sharpie and to make it look more like a galaxy I'm gonna draw these lines and dots and I am done and it looks like a whole new agenda but this one's so much better and more much magical <laughs> So that was that you guys, so hopefully you guys liked this video and if you guys did don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe down below because we're almost to like a thousand subscribers which to me it's like so crazy because I literally start from zero now to be there almost so close it's like a dream come true but hopefully you guys like this video keep enjoying your summer I know that we're going back to school pretty soon but just don't panic because I know that you're gonna do great and you're gonna pass all of your classes because if I can do this you can do this um so thank you guys so much for watching and like I said keep enjoying your summer and I will see you guys next time bye What's that sound?